If someone who is Abrahamic religious doesn't omit the anti-gay parts of the Bible or Quran from their beliefs, are they hateful or anti-gay? Must Abrahamic religious people jettison parts of their beliefs in order to not be anti-gay? Or is it only when they state those views aloud that it becomes anti-gay? See, this is why I don't understand why anyone gay would stick with a religion that effectively hates them. But to some people, I'm viewing this wrong. To me, it doesn't really matter whether it's just the sex acts themselves that are hated, or whether it's homosexuality itself that is hated by this God person. It's still declaring that someone shouldn't show affection for someone they love. It's still declaring that unless you live a very particular lifestyle and strive to raise a traditional family, you're going against the wishes of a supreme being. But is that belief anti-gay? Is it hateful? To be fair, the dogmatic extremes of both sides, the religious and the ideological, like to claim that their hate is based on love. It would be entertaining if it wasn't so destructive.